The CUNA School District is coming together to provide weekend meals and snacks for students in need. It's all part of CUNA's weekend backpack program, which around 100 students and their families rely on. Six on your side, Stephanie Hale Lopez has the story. I had no idea that it'd be this big. A big goal for some small kids. Students at CUNA's Crimson Point Elementary School collecting nearly 4,000 food items for their peers at risk of hunger on the weekends. Now we've kind of extended it to like boxes of granola bars, popcorn, pudding, like that kind of stuff. Sixth graders Chloe and Emma help collect the donations every morning. And so far, the school has more than doubled its original goal of 1,500 items. Within a matter of just a couple days, we had already peaked our original goal. So then we had to set another goal for 5,000, and we're already over 3,000. All of the food supports the district's weekend backpack program, which provides meals and snacks to students in need. We ended up getting a little bit of support from the Idaho Food Bank. They support us with 15 bags per week for only three of our buildings and we have 10 in our district and we have 5,000 kids in our district and a need of about 100 kids a week. Despite receiving assistance from the Idaho Food Bank, the district still has to assemble about 85 backpacks for its students. For the staff, the program means students are able to attend school on Monday well nourished. But for the students, it's a valuable lesson in the importance of helping others. We filled up 11 boxes in like almost under the under a week and we still have so many more weeks to go. I'm really excited to see what happens. Stephanie Hill Lopez, six on your side. If you'd like to help out, you can drop off on perishable food items at any school in CUNA from now through uh, the end of the month. Uh, you can make a monetary donation also to the Idaho Food Bank.